xin chào tất cả các bạn, mình là Irene đến từ Coi 68 và trong video ngày hôm nay chúng ta sẽ tiếp tục series Crypto Life Talk với buổi EMA đến từ dự án DeFi mang tên là A-Star. Đây là một trung tâm cơ sở dữ liệu hạ tầng DeFi hub ở trên Cardano và A-Star thì cung cấp các dịch vụ tài chính mở và phát triển ứng dụng phi tài chính tập trung ở trên hệ sinh thái của Cardano. Các sản phẩm cốt lõi của A-Star thì sẽ bao gồm là Launchpad, Deck, Money Market và Tech Services à, và trong buổi em ngày hôm nay thì Irene sẽ được trao đổi với ở một khách mời đến từ A Star à, đó chính là John A Star Marketing và Community Lead. So hello everyone, it's me Irene from Coisix Chat and today we back with another episode of Life Talk of Crypto Life Talk and today I'm so happy to welcome a new project that is A Star. So A Star is a key DeFi infrastructure hub on Cardano that features a lot of applications such as Launchpad, Dex, Money Market, and Tech Services with the backing of Emugo, a founding member of Cardano Protocol. So before anything else, let me introduce you our guest here. He is John, A Star Marketing and Community Lead. Hi, John. Hello, Irene. Thank you uh, for having me here today. Really nice to be sitting down with you for this discussion. Uh, uh, regards A Starter, a DeFi infrastructure hub on Cardano. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, as usual, can you um, introduce about yourself and A Starter? Yeah, indeed. So my role is primarily in the capacity of community and marketing lead for A Starter. Uh, a Starter is a DeFi infrastructure hub on Cardano. Uh, so for myself, I have a deep understanding of IT, information technology, and the rise of cryptocurrency and blockchain protocol ecosystems. Uh, so it's an ex exciting time for me to be a part of such a fantastic team as a starter and to see the pace of innovation, particularly with the rise of decentralized finance. Uh, and for me, the D in DeFi, the decentralization is very important. Uh, and we can talk a little bit more about that a bit later on. But uh, in terms of A Starter, A Starter is a joint venture. It began with um, the idea of creating a suite of applications, core applications, that is a launch pad, launch pool, DEX, money market, and tech service platform. With the backing of Emergo, a founding member of the Cardano protocol. Uh, so a starter, we aim to elevate our contribution to bring broader possibilities to the Cardano ecosystem by providing fair, safe and accessible open finance services to meet existing and future demands in accelerating DeFi applications, uh, which can help empower the next generation of projects building on the Cardano platform. Yeah. Yeah, that's so impressive and informative. So just to follow up, um, can you talk more about the outstanding achievement that a star had achieved in the past time? Yes, launch pad. Uh, so uh, we launched our open beta for our launch pad in May 2022. It was around the 25th of May 2022. And we attracted some 6,000 plus community members Um, of which some, when the majority, some uh, 5,800 of those that participated provided feedback. Uh, and this helped to grow the community. Uh, so that was valuable feedback in the development, the open beta development phase of our launch pad. We also completed the first transaction on the A Starter decentralized exchange, ADEX, um, on a testnet, Cardano testnet, in June of the same year, 2022. We launched uh, our ISPO, uh, initial stake pool offering, in September 2022. And this allows for ADAR token holders to stake their ADAR to the AA1 staking pool and earn rewards in the AA token, which is our project token. Uh, so this gives early access to um, the AA and the A starter ecosystem through staking to that stake pool. And it rewards every five days, so it's every uh, epoch duration. We released uh, a launch pool preview on October the same year, October 2022, 
preparing to bring multi-token rewards to the community. Uh, launched uh, ADEX version one closed beta this month, uh, April 2023. And this allows users to come in and test the ASTARA decentralized exchange platform. Um, and we integrated six leading Cardano wallets, including NAMI wallet, URI wallet, NuFi wallet, Flint wallet, Eternal wallet, and the recently released Lace wallet. Um, so all of those wallets can be used to access ADEX. And of course, all of those wallets can also be used to stake ADA to the AA1 stake pool uh, to earn rewards in the AA token. So that's that's some of our achievements um, as we've during our development phase. Hmm, I see you guys have achieved a lot of outstanding achievement. Um, yeah, right. As um, I have researched uh, about your project before, I know that I started build a lot of um, good uh, product, but uh, I think that now uh, not a lot of people know about it. So what the uh, valuable application has a startup provide in the Cardano ecosystem? Can you share about that? Yeah, what have we provided in the Cardano ecosystem? Well, ASTAR has provided several valuable applications to the Cardano ecosystem, including the ASTAR Launchpad. Uh, this is a decentralized platform uh, for launching new products on Cardano. So this allows for startups to raise funds from uh, the community and provides investors with a platform to discover and invest in promising new projects, okay? So that's that's one of the things that we bring to the Cardano ecosystem. We also bring the A Starter Decentralized Exchange, ADEX, uh, and this very much complements the Launchpad. Uh, ADEX is a decentralized exchange that allows users to trade Cardano-based assets in a trustless and permissionless manner, okay? ADEX is built on top of the Cardano black blockchain, and provides a secure and transparent trading environment for users. We've developed an ISPO, initial state pool offering, and we've delivered on that ISPO as well since um, first uh, researching that with the Cardano community. So the ISPO um, initial state pool offering provides an innovative way for early stage projects to fundraise and build a community. Uh, the ISPO allows Cardano holders to delegate their ADA to a specific project staking pool and earn rewards in the future. Okay, so it's it's another fundraising mechanism, uh, which is quite unique to Cardano platform, and it enables people to use their existing assets to raise uh, project tokens. So overall, a starter's products have contributed to the growth and development of the Cardano ecosystem. Uh, we provide valuable tools and opportunities for startups, investors, and community members alike. Uh, so this is some of our, you know, the, some of the things we've provided to the Cardano ecosystem, very much building grassroots. And we, you know, during during those these times, what what we'll look to do is, as we roll out our pro products, is expand the Cardano community and bring more users to the Cardano ecosystem through the A Starter platform. Mm. Um, so, uh, in me, myself, i pretty impressive with the uh, ASTAR Launchpad. So, what is the highlight of ASTAR Ideal Launchpad platform? Uh, maybe to uh, attract new projects uh, in the Cardano um, ecosystem? Yeah, ASTAR is IDEO Launchpad. Okay, so the platform has several highlights that make it attractive mm. for new projects, uh, including easy to use IDO launchpad platform. Uh, it is easy to use and provides a user-friendly interface that enables projects to launch uh, their tokens quickly. We have a, a one-click token issuance feature, for example. Low fees, the platform offers low fees uh, for launching tokens, uh, which helps projects save money and reduces the barriers of entry. Uh, so uh, a very low barrier to entry. Um, strong community support. A Starter has a strong and active community uh, that supports new projects, which helps increase the visibility of new projects and attract more users. Okay, access to funding. A Starter's IDEO Launchpad uh, 
platform provides access to funding for projects which helps them grow and develop secure and transparent okay so built in native haskell it offers a lot of security um it's not easy to build in native haskell uh, we've built the platform in native haskell from the ground up uh, so th that brings a lot of security to the, the the platform so the platform is secure it's transparent which helps build trust uh, from users and ensure their investments are protected so overall a starters ido launch pad platform provides a comprehensive uh, solution for new projects looking to launch their tokens okay providing everything from funding to community support and access to multiple blockchains through interoperability um and one more thing uh when i read your about your project i see something called money market so mm -hmm. maybe can you talk talk about it and um yeah. How can it um, attract more users? For example, maybe about the interest uh, rate and time, maybe, right? Yeah, the interest rate and time. Well, A Starters Money Market Platform aims to provide lending and borrowing services to users. Okay, so think collateralized lending and borrowing. Uh, so for the Cardano ecosystem, here are some of the ways the platform can attract users. Okay, competitive interest rates. A Starters Money Market Platform can offer competitive interest rates for borrowers, okay, and lenders, which can attract users to the platform. Lenders can earn a return on their ADA holdings, okay. So if you're hodling ADA, you can actually use that as collateral to to borrow um, and lend through the, the the platform. While borrowers can access funding at a lower interest rate than traditional financial institutions. So this is re really something that the De DeFi is bringing to um, the financial world, this collateralized lending and borrowing through uh, cryptocurrencies. Uh, so accessible to all, okay, it reduces those barriers to entry. As we discussed earlier, money market platform can be accessible to all users uh, of the Cardano ecosystem. So if you're holding ADA, mm -hmm. there's a money market there that you can access. Um, it can increase the potential user base for the Cardano ecosystem. This can be achieved by keeping the minimum amount required to borrow or lend low and by enabling a wide range of assets to be used as collateral. Okay, Flexible lending and borrowing terms. Okay, so the terms can be flexible. The money market platform, the money market platform can be accessible to all users of a Cardano ecosystem. Yeah, I was just saying, such as, to give some examples, such as the ability to choose the length of the loan and the interest rate. This can help borrowers mm -hmm. and lenders tailor the platform to their specific needs and financial goals. A uh, money market platform can provide transparency and security uh, to its users by allowing them to track their transactions and collateral in real time it can also uh, ensure the security of user funds through the use of smart contracts and advanced security protocols protocols so overall the money market platform can provide a reliable and convenient way for users to access funding and earn a return on their assets which can uh, be attractive to users uh, of the cardano ecosystem Hmm, yeah, so the money market part is really interesting. Uh, I'm sure that uh, a starter's uh, decentralized exchange uh, will also have many favors for user race. Um, can you talk uh, about the highlight that can attract new users of uh, a starter decentralized exchange as well? Yeah, sure. A starter's decentralized exchange, ADEX, aims to provide users with fast, secure, and low cost trading experiences. Uh, so some of the highlights that can attract new users, high liquidity, ADEX leverages liquidity pools, okay, to ensure high trading volumes and low slippage rates. This is achieved through partnerships with leading liquidity providers such as Band Protocol, Umbrella Product Network, and more. Uh, so, um, partnerships with leading liquidity providers. This can uh, help increase liquidity. 
fast and secure. ADEX utilizes the Cardano blockchain, okay, which has high transaction speeds and security. Additionally, ADEX uses advanced security measures like multi-sig wallets and hot cold wallet storage to ensure user funds are safe. Okay, low fees, ADEX charges a low trading fee, 0.2%. And users can also earn rewards by staking their uh, tokens on the platform. Okay, so it's user-friendly interface. Uh, it is comparable with centralized exchanges. So uh, providing that user interface, ADEX has a... Uh, interface that makes trading easy and accessible for both novice and experienced traders. Overall, ADEX offers a competitive decentralized exchange that provides users with many benefits over centralized exchanges, including increased security, lower fees, and more open and transparent trading experiences. Hmm, that's really impressive to me. I think I should use ADEX right away. But yes. um, just one thing, <laughs> just one thing I really um, like. I still have a problem with is that the security problem. So currently, as you know, that um, uh, a lot of uh, decentralized exchanges got hacked. Right, Sushi Swap got hacked, and uh, Uniswap was also hacked in like July twenty twenty two, as I uh, remember. So maybe mm. um, can you share more about uh, what is the strength of um, a start a decentralized change to bring more security uh, to the user, normal user like me. Yeah. Yeah, indeed. Um, so a, a lot of those um, hacks that you talk about tend to be with EVM, Ethereum virtual machines. There's, and there's, there's, so there's a lot of developers developing on the EVM platforms. We're building in native Haskell on Cardano, which is, um, it's a you know, Haskell, it's a functional programming language. It's, it's, very secure okay um so as a start as a project we take security uh, very seriously it's a concern uh, for any decentralized exchange uh and a starter we take several measures to ensure the safety of user assets and here are some of the key security features okay uh, so a starter will implement audits uh, we have undergone multiple security audits to ensure that the smart contracts powering the exchange are secure and free from vulnerabilities. So that's some of the things we can do security. So besides building a native Haskell, uh, which is very secure in itself, we have those smart contracts audited. All right. Multi-signature wallets. We use multi-sig wallets to ensure that funds can only be moved when authorized by multiple parties. So that's using... Uh, hot and cold storage wallets and uh, with the adoption of multi-sig -sig wallets. Uh, this reduces the risk of single point of failure. User control funds. Uh, ASTAR allows users to maintain control over their funds throughout the trading process. Uh, users' funds are never held by a starter or any third party, reducing the, th the risk of theft. So contract upgradability. Uh, our smart contracts are designed to be upgradable, allowing the team to address any security issues that may arise very quickly. Overall, uh, ASALA has taken a proactive approach to security, implementing a range of measures to ensure the safety of user assets. While no exchange can guarantee 100% security, uh, we feel uh, we've taken steps to minimize the risk of hacks and other security breaches, and we continue to do so. Okay, through audits uh, and um, for thorough testing of the products uh, to stay uh, up to date and bring our next version, ADEX V2, uh, so that you will love and trust it more. Um, so, yeah, um, me, myself, as a user, I really appreciate that you guys really put a lot of effort on building security features on a star decks. I think there's one question that a lot of um, Cardano builder, project builder and Cardano and about and um like developer they will really care about is like when a project want to build on Cardano, so what infrastructure will a starter support for the new projects? 
Yeah, I, support's very important for, for startup projects, right? So if a new project wants to build on Cardano, uh, a startup can provide support through its launch pad initially and other infrastructure components. So as I was talking about the, the DEX and the money market, those can complement projects that are launching through the launch pad. Okay, so through the launch pad, a startup can offer services to assist new projects with fundraising uh, and community building including assistance with token issuance we have that one click token issuance um, tool there that they can use we have liquidity provision services uh, and of course marketing initiatives that the uh, projects the startups can uh, leverage to bring their products their, their services to market uh, so all of that as well as the trust that going through a recognized launch pad can bring um, in addition uh, a starter can provide technical support uh, to new projects through infrastructure components such as the decentralized exchange money market and of course the DAO governance platform uh, this support can include assistance with smart contract development security audits and integration with other cardano based applications so overall uh, a starter aims to provide a comprehensive suite of infrastructure and services to help new projects build and grow on the Cardano ecosystem. Hmm. Okay, um, I think our AMA is quite long. So just one last question. Um, maybe in the near future, will a starter have any new updates to improve um, your products? Yeah, sure. In the near future, our launch party is going live on Mainnet. Uh, very exciting time, April, May this year. Okay, so we'll be uh, going live with our launch pad. Um, our decentralized exchange mainnet release will follow in June. Uh, and additionally, uh, as a starter continues to grow, it is likely that our team will implement further updates and features to optimize the platforms and provide users with more valuable tools and services. So a lot happening right now during April and May with the launch of the launch pad. Uh, the DEX will follow in June. Uh, so yeah, very exciting times. Yeah, so maybe I think it's all of our AMA sessions today. So thank you a lot, John, for joining uh, us and giving a lot of uh, informative answers. I believe that our community now gets to understand a lot about your project A Starter. And thank you once again. I hope A Starter is going to be so successful in the future. And I believe that you guys are going to rock it. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Irene. It's great to be here. Yeah, just uh, let me sum up by Vietnamese and then um, we gonna, mm -hmm. we can uh, end it here. Yeah. Ok, uh, và có lẽ thì đây sẽ là phần kết thúc cho buổi AMA ngày hôm nay giữa Coi68 và Astar. Cảm ơn tất cả mọi người đã theo dõi buổi AMA ngày hôm nay. Và nếu như anh em quan tâm về dự án thì có thể theo dõi uh, website cũng như là mạng xã hội của Astar. Mình sẽ để ở bên dưới phần bình luận cũng như là phần mô tả cho anh em. Uh, ngoài ra thì nếu như anh em có bất kỳ thắc mắc nào thì cũng có thể comment ở phía bên dưới phần bình luận. Uh, và uh, nếu như anh em thích video này thì đừng quên like, share và subscribe Coi68 TV để có thể nhận được những thông tin mới nhất về thị trường crypto mỗi ngày nhé. Cảm ơn anh em đã theo dõi video này và hẹn gặp anh em trong những video sau. Bye!